Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo and welcome back today to a Minecraft 1.9 one command creation. Now this creation is absolutely amazing and it introduces helicopters to survival. Now this was designed and created by Max Dine. It does require a resource pack, options, resource pack. You can see the helicopter pack by Max Dine. It's easy to install these, you should have no problem at all. Now the cool thing about this actual command is it is designed for survival. By this I mean there is naturally a villager that can spawn called the mechanic that you can trade with. It is very expensive, but for a world like this to explore, it's absolutely amazing. So if you do enjoy this and you would like to see more videos similar to this, be sure to thumbs it up. I really appreciate the support and it lets me know that you guys enjoy the videos I do make. So. You need a command block. If you're a noob and don't know how to get a command block, it's forward slash give, then your name, and then command. And then as you guys can see, that is the block. This will give you a command block. Now the command is in the description from Max Stein's website. I'm gonna go away from there because that's where I'm gonna spawn it. So simply place down the command, set it to always active, paste in the command, click on done, and this will load up this device. Now if you simply wanna get rid of this, you just simply right click destroy machine, it will get rid of it. The actual command will no longer be active, but it's good to have in your Minecraft world. Now, what I'm hoping to do around the release of Minecraft 1.9 is to do a custom command, uh, custom commands let's play, which could be like helicopters, custom mobs, custom builds, and things like that. So that'd be something else I can do. So the next thing we need to do here is get the villager. Now, again, it is a rarity, but this one spawned first time. Let's see how many we can see. Okay, so we spawned quite quite easily with a spawn egg. Now, it will tell you that's a, a normal mechanic. These are just normal villages, normal trades. But this guy here, for 64 diamonds, yes, it's expensive. You can grab the helicopter. So that is exactly what we're gonna do. So this is the helicopter itself. Now the next one is fuel. Now that's just not normal coal. It's not normal coal, so you have to trade for it. Um, but I'm gonna grab a, a bunch of this because you can run out quite easy. Now the last one here is a wrench. The wrench is used to pick up the actual helicopter if you're done with it. So I recommend grabbing quite a few. Um, so we're gonna grab as many as we can. So we've got quite a bunch there, don't need to spend any more. And then it gets interesting. So this is what it looks like in your hand. It's absolutely huge. And this is why it's important that you have the resource pack on. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna place it here. To place it, you need to just literally throw it on the floor. So I'm gonna throw it with Q. And you can see here the helicopter is spawned in. So it's, it's a pretty big helicopter to pick it up. Again, use the wrench, this will pick up the helicopter. Um, and these cost five gold at a time. So be very careful when you put it down and pick it up So again, just throw it on the floor. This will spawn it in uh, and you need to fuel it now to fuel it You simply throw the fuel on the floor, but sometimes this doesn't register so this can take you some time So I'm just gonna do this I'm not entirely sure how much it costs to fuel it But I'm just making sure it does register underneath you'll know it is it's working because it's gone from underneath the uh, the helicopter So it does show a particle effect once the uh, helicopter is fully fueled so we're gonna fully fuel this. Hopefully it doesn't take too much. I think it's a total of like, I don't know. <clears throat> it's close to 60. As you guys can see, it's close to 60 there. So um, it's a lot, in clo sorry, close to 50, I don't know. It's just, it's quite a lot. You need to put a lot of coal in there, a lot of fuel. Um, and to get in it, all you simply do is right click on the actual helicopter. Now, as you guys can see, press L uh, left to dismount, which is obviously the normal shift. So I'm gonna go in like third person, you can see here. Now you need to use these. So it's like slot what I think it's slot four five and six So I'm gonna quickly move my wrench out the way because you toggle with these so for example to go up It's gonna be this one which is six in your hotbar to go down It's four to hover it's five so you can see we're hovering so it's really good for a map like this to explore and the fact that you can do this in Minecraft survival I thought was absolutely priceless now. I don't know if I can see myself unfortunately you can't see yourself um, but it's just, it's remarkable. And this is why I placed my FOV all the way up, my field of view. And I was just messing around with it. I'm in normal Minecraft creative just for the tutorial, but this works in survival. And it's just absolutely phenomenal that it's possible in default Minecraft just with one command. The one command creations are absolutely priceless. So you can see here, we're just exploring got a church there. You've got like town halls. You've got like, I don't know, I think this world might have pixel art. I'll try and link the world down below as well so you can explore it. But a full credit to Max Stein. I've done a lot of showcases that he has done, like the Transformers. Um, we've done like the, the staffs, the four different staffs. But it's just endless. If you've ever wanted to go on a Minecraft helicopter ride, now is the chance. You have to be on the latest snapshot, which I think is 15W, 
1B, I think it is. Uh, Minecraft 1.9 is soon to be out on Mac stand, so he's going to be releasing a bunch more. It doesn't have sounds, unfortunately. Uh, oops. Okay, so we ran out of fuel, which is something I forgot to teach you. Now, you'll run out of fuel when you hit... I need to get off this. You'll run out of fuel uh, when this starts to turn black, so like black smoke's on it. So you're going to have to throw a bunch more of these in. I don't know if I can throw the whole thing. Let me see if I can throw the whole thing. I don't think it works like that. It doesn't. So you can see you can't throw it. You have to throw them one by one, which is quite unfortunate, but hey... This works like this, and if you were in survival, then you would have died. So once it starts displaying black smoke, you're in trouble. All right, you're 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 pretty much in trouble. So it's just any more? Is it registering? I don't think, yes, no, maybe it's not. It's not registering. Okay, well we can probably get back on top of it now. Again, we right click. We're gonna go back up. Let's go to this mode. Nope. F1. This mode. I'm sitting on top of it now. This is not supposed to happen, but hey, I guess we kind of broke it. I think our machine is generally broken. Okay, I definitely broke it. But again, if you want to pick it up, I think it's just cute. It should pick it up. It won't let me because I think it's class as being broken, which is why I can't pick this up. Um, so we would have to go back to the village and trade again. But I'm going to let you guys explore it. I just thought it was a different thing to showcase. And you can see how far we did travel. So you, you can travel quite far while using this, but I, I really wanted to showcase it because I love the one command creations because it requires you to install no mods at all. Sometimes it's a resource pack, sometimes it's not. Um, but the villager should still be over here somewhere. Hopefully. Is he here? He's over there, over there. Alright, so once you're done, you don't want to use the command anymore. You simply come over to this contraption, right click on the sign, and this will pretty much get rid of it. But it's gone off there because I think I broke it. So overall, thumbs up from me. Thank you so much, Max Time, for the design. Take care, stay beautiful, and as always, I'll catch you next time. Bye!